if you had to throw out a name, uh, who would you like to fight other than Tiago Alves? Because <laughs> he was the only one I was going to mention. <laughs> um, I don't know, man. I, I haven't really thought about it too much, to be honest. I'm, I actually just got a, uh, a new four fight uh, contract from the UFC. I got to turn in. But uh, yeah, I, I don't know who. Um, actually, Joe Silva had mentioned that uh, Tiago Alves had kind of had some talk about maybe wanting to fight me and mention me by name and you know i don't know how excited joe was about that but um you know it could always be a possibility i don't know i guess we're him and i are both coming off of losses now so it's a possibility but um yeah other than him i i, I really don't know so this whole notion that uh, we've all heard you know people online and stuff uh they've uh, there's a lot of people out there that criticize criticized Kempavia and a lot of people have said on forums that fighters cannot progress if they are with Kempavia. Uh, can we throw that out the window now since you're coming off a loss and you had just confirmed that you signed a brand new contract with the UFC? It really has nothing to do with Ken? Well, actually some uh, interesting things have developed uh, in the last few weeks with Ooh. MMA agents and Ken Pavia. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't tell. even think about I didn't even think about it until you know we started having this conversation. Um a few weeks back, it was actually right before my fight, um Ken had called me and said that uh an agency called Paradigm had bought MMA agents and uh you know they were gonna be the controlling company and uh really ken was just doing client relations and something else i forget what he said but uh you know he he assured us that you know uh it was going to take you know that image of heat the ufc has on mma agents and take that off the fighters if there ever was any and you know it, it would put us in a better spot because they have more you know services to offer the clients blah 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 so um Really, I'm not sure what Ken's exact role is with the company now or even if he has one, but um, the guy's name that runs Paradigm is a guy named Adi Attar, and uh, he was there for my fight. Real cool guy, um, handled things that need to be handled and uh, you know did a great job, but um, yeah, so it's I, I'm still actually in the midst of figuring out exactly what's going on with that. I got an email from uh, Audi I need to go through still and figure out exactly what the relationship is between Paradigm and MMA agents and, and uh, you know, what's going on. But I got that email, I think it was just yesterday, but still need to read that. But yeah, some interesting things are going on there and, uh, you know, we'll, we'll see what happens. <laughs> so it, it sounds like Paradigm, you said Paradigm or Paradigm? paradigm okay it sounds like they might just be you know a, a front for mma agents just the ability to give them a new name is it, from your understanding is that pretty much what it is no from what i understand is this other guy is taking over and mma agents has been acquired it's an acquisition okay so mma agents is no longer mma agents at all Kimpavia doesn't own it uh this new guy audi owns it and it has gotten a name change so completely different company a completely different company, completely different representation, and different service. I mean, this guy also does uh, uh, NFL players and I think uh, Major League Baseball as well, and just added uh, MMA to his agency with the acquisition of MMA agents. Cool, man. That's definitely something that I didn't know, and I haven't seen it reported anywhere. Well, it just anywhere. happened. Yeah, it just happened. So, I mean... I don't know if they've been trying to keep that on the down low or whatever. I, I'm not sure that they've really been trying to keep it on the down low. I mean, I'm, sh I'm sure it's something they've wanted to, I mean, at least from Audi's perspective, wanted to let the UFC, hey, I'm taking this company. It's now in my control. MMA agents is, you know, no more. I am the company. So. Well, people will definitely know now. Um, yeah, I guess. <laughs> 